What's up, everybody? Welcome to my channel. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Welcome back to the old subscribers. I'm doing some love twist readings for all the signs. And um, I was requested to do Aries. So we will see what the love messages are for the sign of Aries from Jesus. From now until the end of April. The bottom is heart to heart conversations. Some need to have a conversation, Aries. Well, Some of you need to work on your third chakra, so Archangel Camel. Or maybe they're trying to work on your third chakra. So, For some of you, might be dealing with somebody who has kids. And they're definitely thinking about you. And the door to romance is open for you. Something is going to be revealed in your dreams. And you have the How Teachable Are You card. So that means kind of being stuck in your ways of how you think about things. Um, kind of stuck to your own opinion about how things should go. Not listening to anyone else's. Maybe yourself. Because I think you have feelings for them, or they have feelings for you. <coughs> Jeez. Some of you need to work on your first chakra. Archangel Michael is trying to assist you. Victim consciousness. Those thoughts where you're like, everybody hates me, nobody likes me. 
I think I'll just eat worms. Get to know the person that has kids. I don't even see anything bad around this other than it seems like you already made up your mind about something. Because there could be abundance here or maybe someone's going to have a baby. Maybe somebody wants to have a baby. I don't know. You have the Knight of Discs or the Knight of Pentacles. So there's new something new, maybe with an Earth sign. But I think it's about being patience, being patience, having patience maybe, or this person is very patient with you. But maybe you're saying that you want to be single, <laughs> or maybe there's something else that you're trying to do right now. You have justice, so it could be dealing with a Libra, but I think that things need to be evened out. Um, balance out the scales a little bit in the situation. Because there is love here. Definitely a baby for some people. Look how many babies she has. And that could be a game changer because it's a major change of direction here with the um, Page of Swords. Maybe you already found, maybe you already know this. Some of you already know this. But there's your card, the Emperor. So you are kind of in a good place to make the right decision about this, I think. There's definitely passion here. There's a Hermit, maybe a Virgo. Things are going to move forward. Three of Swords. Are you afraid of getting your heart broken? Are you depressed? Stressed the fuck out maybe with the Ten of Wands? You can manifest whatever you want in your life with the Magician. There's probably some other people in your business. Disagreements. Someone who wants a stable foundation but they're holding back about how they feel. But you guys are both waiting. Things are going to change. Maybe you're dealing with a Scorpio. Getting rid of the old shit coming back better. Because there's this motherly person that's waiting. <laughs> but you're stuck in your head about it. Or maybe you learned some truth, but eh, it's your soulmate. So, try something new. Or maybe they'll try to, they are going to try something new once they realize this. Things definitely haven't been revealed to you. Might be a little bit obsessive. But there's a decision that's going to be made, I think. Thinking about it, right? Maybe paranoid you're going to be left out on the cold. Then the tower hits. And something balances out. Someone comes back balanced, but still kind of holding back. Standing up for yourself or maybe just closing yourself out of from this person but yet there's balance here and love and a new start but are you going to make a decision or are you going to stand here there's definitely a cycle maybe a lot of choices really fast communication a judgment call, happiness, some things being said, maybe about an emotional disconnect. Someone wants to work with you and come, there's an earth sign for some of you that there's going to be a new start with. Not only that, but someone who really cares about you and is going to, wants like this committed, like they want to get married and shit. Kids are fucking crazy, but they're fun, okay? How teachable are you? Are you willing to hear anybody else's opinion? 
something with you, James, is important. Someone's thinking about you. First chakra. Door to romance is open. Good to know them, even if they have kids. For others of you, or maybe this is the same situation, I really don't know. True love and religious factors. Hmm. So, okay, that's way too many. Way too many. Maybe they're a little bit different than you about how they grew up or how they think. Maybe they're not the same race as you, but it's still love. Love is love no matter what the color is. Shit. Some of you have a fire, a fire sign. Maybe it's time to communicate or there will be communication. <coughs> it's time to make a choice. Realize you're in a cycle. You ain't going nowhere. Um, make a choice, again, with the high priestess. This person is really supportive of you or wants to support you, but you're stuck in your head. And some things got to change, okay? There will be changes with the death card. Someone really cares about you. I think they're going to be telling you that. There's a solid ground to stand on. And a new start. So this kind of is the same story over and over again. Anyways. King of Wands. You, right? So you know what you want. And you're going to move forward. <coughs> Excuse me. You have the strength card. There's some shit you got to get over, Aries. Trample the worm like this... I don't know. Or a dragon or whatever it is. Get over some shit. Especially if you feel like you're going to be rejected. This is something that needs to heal. Who's going to reject an Aries? Do they even take no for an answer? <sighs> um, Knight of Pentacles. There again, it's telling you to branch out. Try something new. Even if they're different from you. Because you guys both want to work together. You're waiting on them. Teamwork. Stop being disconnected. Goddess of the Moon, I feel like there are some things manifesting in this situation that you guys are really unaware. I think there's some shit being done behind the scenes, to be honest. You have storm warning. So this could be some shit that goes down. Is it the end of the world? Probably not, but it's something to be aware of. Something to do with people you're around. Somebody needs to get over um, a past broken heart. Because this is true love. The romance of a lifetime. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. Hmm. But yet there's this new start with the page. No one knight. But one of his eyes is gone, so I don't know. You guys are definitely in a psycho. With somebody. This situation involves marriage. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. You deserve love. You are lovable. I see a lot of anxiety. You guys need to take a nap. You need some rest. The angel of balance is trying to come into your life to help you balance some shit out. Maybe you should call on them. Her think it's a her yeah it's a her 
some of you need some help with your four chakra Archangel Raphael or they're working with you with this you need to take a nap Ooh. <coughs> moon card So I think maybe someone's not telling you that they want a reunion with you, maybe. Four of Wands with the Moon card. Maybe it's a Pisces. Maybe because you're being really self-defensive and closing yourself out. But yet, yeah, you're still waiting. Two of Wands. Maybe you haven't told this person that you want to get back together with them. Because you're making it seem like you don't. Because you're still going through some shit. Maybe it's a divorce. Yeah, it's a divorce for some people. Which is causing you to retreat. But yet there's love here. Choice that probably needs to be made. Getting over a situation that you were left. Maybe someone abandoned you. Someone moved on from you. need to get over it that's what they're saying because you do have you know I think you have passion for something and a renewal um, long-term commitment justice will be served for all things on justice -y. someone's thinking about you someone's coming back from the past hanged man I don't think they're a very good person now with the Seven of Swords that they weren't in the past. Because all you got was loss and regret. Someone abandoned you. Someone does want to work with you. Abundance. Hermit. Magician. It's the same thing. Yet yeah, you still have a soulmate here. You need to try something new. And the wheel's going to turn either way. You must have something to say maybe to a Gemini or somebody you love. You're stuck in your head, or they are maybe holding back from an earth sign that there could be a wish to fulfillment with. You try to make a choice about actually communicating with them or going for it. Reciprocity, marriage, passion. Come on. You guys will figure it out. That's all I have for Pisces. Oh, I just said Pisces. I don't know why I said Pisces. That's all I have for Aries.